Hello everybody. Once again, it's me, Kenneth, from On The Wheel, from everything from The Wheelchair Cooking Show. Uh, today I'm going to be cooking on a budget. Uh, today's show is called Cooking on a Budget. You know, fun to like, I think I spend like ten, ten dollars, ten dollars, okay. I'm going to get started. Get it right there, okay. Um, Right there. Okay. First of all, I went to the store and got some fresh apples in a can. I'm gonna make some apples. Today, show I'm make some apples. This can of apples cost me uh, 59 cents. I'm gonna make some apples. Apple right there. I'm gonna cook them today, but I'm gonna do it all. I'm gonna do it for on a budget for the budget. I got some uh, some poor uh, some beef tips right here. So what I'm gonna do? I'm uh, I'm uh, what I'm gonna do with my beef tips? I'm gonna bake them, but I'm gonna put them in some room before the bake them. And so I got some uh. Some chili pepper right here. I'm gonna sprinkle that on there a little bit. I put some holes, took a knife, put some holes in there. And I'm gonna put a little of my friend seasoning salt on there that I'll be using. I don't want seasoning salt that I'll be using on there. Okay. Uh, real, but not real good. Okay. Number four. This right here, these beef, these beef tips, they cost me six forty, six forty nine, and I got the can of apples. It cost me fifty nine. I'm gonna put some uh, pineapples in here. Pineapples in now. Get a little extra flavor with all that stuff I got in there. You know, I'll uh, be till some extra flavor. Fold up like that. And now we put it in the, uh, in the oven and let it steam cook. Put it in the oven and let it steam cook. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna put a little cinnamon and look a little bit of cinnamon in my apples. Cause they going good. The cinnamon in there. And a little brown sugar in there. In my apple. Just a little bit, not too much. Okay. Stir them up. Get this uh, this pack of noodles at the dollar store. It costs one nineteen. It's like noodles and cheese and broccoli all of it mixed together. I get that. I had about that for like one nineteen. And I'm gonna show y'all what my uh, what my meat look like when I take it out. Of, when I take it out. Yeah. 
Y'all know I had the pineapples in there. Okay, that's what it looked like when I boiled it. When I steam, when I steam cooked it. Okay. Now, get my plate over here. Okay. Some of my meat out. Y'all know I put that chili pepper on there. The chili sauce on there. I like a little pineapple in here. Whenever I'm cooking meat and stuff, I like to use a little pineapple because I like to, I like to be different than the next person. Put that right there. My apple seems to be done. My apples, it cost me 59 cents. Everything I got here, everything I have here, costs about $10 at the most. I'm gonna break some of my wheelchair, because I won't slide around, move around, because of my apples right here. Y'all can see I still got some apples left over. And so you get, you say you go to a restaurant and stuff and spend like $10. You don't have no food left over. Okay. Get the noodles I was telling you about with the broccoli and everything. Some that left over. Got that left over. A full course meal, everything for a little bit of nothing. That's what I call cooking on a budget. Everything less than ten dollars. See that? And um, uh, you know I got I have a lot of businesses going on. I have a. Uh, Lawn service business. I have a detailing, a detail cars, and I clean carpet. As a matter of fact, I cleaned somebody's carpet yesterday. It took me pretty much all day to do it, though. But uh, at the same time, I'm trying to say, uh, if it's something in your heart that you want to do it, do it. Don't let life pass you up. Just sitting in the house, just sitting in the house, not doing nothing. You know, if it's something in your heart that you want to do, whether you in a wheelchair or, or whatnot, you know, do what you got to do. You know, you don't want to get old and be like, I wish I would have did that, I wish I would have went there. Or you don't want to uh, let life pass you by and see someone on TV and be like, yeah, I, I thought of that. And then they ain't doing it, you know, you could have made it happen. You know, uh, if you try something and it don't work, just try it again. You know, because uh, it took me a long time to do what I'm doing or to get where I'm at. And I'm still not where I'm at. Uh, I'm still not where I want to be, but I'm working on it. Sometimes I get down and don't want to do nothing, but uh, I pick myself up and go out there and try to do it and make it happen. And that's what you got to do. Don't let nobody, don't never let nobody tell you what you can and cannot do. Only you can stop your dream. If you have a dream, make your dream happy. Happen. And once again, thank y'all for watching my show. Everything from the Wheelchair Cooking Show is me, Kelf, your host. And I appreciate y'all again for 
for watching me and supporting me. And like I always say, if you want somebody to support what you're doing, support what somebody else is doing. Everything from the wheelchair cookie show. Look how good that looks. It ain't taking me no time to make it. Now see if I had some kids or something, I still I still have leftovers. For the ten dollars. Everything comes about ten dollars. So uh, y'all be blessed. Keep watching to my show and uh, thank y'all for tuning in and uh, blessing me and support what I'm doing. God bless you.